All right, welcome back to Audio Describe Gaming. I'm your host, Matt, playing some more South Park, The Fractured But Whole. So I have to find that one device, so I have to turn on, what is it, inspection mode. Let me see what Cartman says about that. Yeah, he's not really saying anything. Yeah, so now I can do inspection mode. So the Stefernity device is that viewfinder from before. So let's get it. Alright, let's give it to Cartman. Well, that took long enough. Stefernity device active. <laughs> really want to be a superhero, huh? Play with the big boys? <sighs> well, maybe. Maybe you can be useful. Have a seat at the table, douchebag. Let's see, mosquitoes, ADLs. Jesus Christ, are these even in a human language? All right, so I'm gonna sit down. All right, in order to play superheroes, you have to have a superhero persona. Then you can fill out your character sheet on Koonstagram. Do you have a Koonstagram page? Oh boy, you're not even on Instagram, huh? Well, I guess I can create one for you. I can't believe it. So the first thing we need to fill out on your character sheet is your class. You know, what kind of superhero are you? Since you're a newbie, you can only choose between three for now. All right, so we got Speedster. Speedster. Uh, the laws of physics are mere suggestions to the Speedster, a hero capable of bending space-time in order to meet out justice. Uh, then there's, let's see. Brutal. Brutalist is a close-range brawler specializing in fist-related injuries and hitting enemies into near-Earth orbit. Blaster. Uh, so for a blaster... Yeah. Uh, don't just watch the world burn, light it on fire yourself as a blaster. These damage dealers are deadly at any range. That's the one I'm going to do. Being, being able to blast stuff out your hands is pretty sweet. Awesome. Okay, douchebag, but now, we need to find out what terrible thing in your past drives you. You see, douche, all superheroes have a compelling backstory. It's from that backstory that their powers gain meaning. Let's take you back to when you were just a child. You lay right. awake that night, like so many other... Let's see, so it's, it's showing it comic book style with little panels, and it shows me at the age I am now, whatever, uh, with a teddy bear in my bed, there's a little macaroni, uh macaroni art on the wall but anyway let's let's see what happens nice. you couldn't sleep because you knew you weren't like the other kids you walked to the mirror so now i'm interacting so i have to walk to the mirror but i can mess around in my room too you walked to the mirror okay let's walk to the mirror you looked in the mirror and you felt alone and that's when it happened a loud noise you swore you could hear your mother calling for help Yeah, and then my, my room is full of like little kid toys. You left your room. Shut up, Cartman. All right, let's leave. Out in the hallway, you saw two intruders in front of your parents' door. You had to stop them from hurting your parents. You knew you had the power to stop them. But for the first time, you called upon your blaster powers. As a blazing blaster hero, you began to overheat as the fire in your belly ignited. All right, so. So I'm in a battle now, and there's there's two guys in my house. So it looks like the first ability I can, the first ability I can do is a blast of fire. So let's do it. Yes, that's what I want to do. Come on. Oh, I have to stand right here to do it. Okay. Oh, it is a timed hit. Okay. Excellent. As the flames clear, the intruders realize what they were up against. Shit, this little flamer means business. Didn't your mom tell you not to play with fire? The intruders moved into attack. 
Looks like I can block, yeah, that's cool. Ooh, I gave him burn damage. Oh, there's a third guy coming in. Alright, so now let's do a knockback attack. Oh, excellent. Alright. So I was going to say, what? so my first attack is I shoot a column of flame in front of me, but I have to be at a distance to do it. Uh, my second attack is I my fist gets uh, surrounded by fire, and I, like, sweep, and it takes out a whole column of enemies. Hey, you can't push us around like that. See if I can figure out the best way to block in this. The controls are similar to Stick of Truth, but they're not exact. Ooh, what's this ability? Oh, I can shoot a whole row of enemies with fire? Let's do it. Ooh, I'm powering up. Oh, it's a big old laser coming out of my hands. Alright, so I knocked out one of the guys. Ooh, so there's a gauge at the top, and it's at 100%. I guess that's like an ultimate attack. Let's see what it does. Ooh, it is a big ultimate attack. Let's see what it does. Okay, so it's showing a cutscene. Oh, I'm breathing in fire. It's coming out my eyes. The fire's going down into my esophagus. And, oh, I'm, I'm farting fire. Oh, my God. So I swallowed fire and farted it out. So you beat them. All seemed to be okay. But then you finally reached your parents' door. And what you saw when you opened that door changed your life forever and led you to fighting crime. You were too late. Because when you opened that door, you saw... You saw your dad fuck your mom. <laughs> what? Whatever, I saw that in Stick of Truth. That's a pretty heavy backstory. You fight crime because you never forgot the night you weren't in time. And you saw your own father, the man you trusted, fuck your mom. It's like a ripple in time you can't ever change, isn't it? Alright, now that you're a superhero, I have a mission for you. I need you to go out into town and try to get as many followers as you can on Coonstagram. It's the only way our franchise will survive. Alright, so uh, I have to mention my costume. So it's a shirt, a black shirt with flames on it. And I think some of the flames are just glued on like paper because some of them are sticking out of the shirt. I'm wearing these big goggles that kind of wrap over the top of my head. Oh, I'm wearing whitey tidies on my head. Okay, and I have glow, a glow stick uh, stuck in it. Uh, and I have, let's see, gloves on. And then taped to each glove is some type of bottle, so it looks like I shoot my powers out of the bottles. I look ridiculous. Anyway, let's let's get some followers. Alright, so I got my costume. Pretty cool. So let's get out of here and let's get some followers. Coonstagram. Oh, I installed the Coonstagram app. Alright, so... Oh. I installed an app called Character Sheet. Hello, child. I'm Jesus. I hear you're the rightful owner of the Relics of Zaron. Check your bedroom toy box. Amen. Oh, I, Ike. Hey, I hear you really like streaming, like super like. Check your toy box. You got the Super Streamer Starter Kit. Uh, Cartman. Let me know if you see any sign of scrambles out there. This is super double top priority. Jimmy. The mayor's aides say she's too busy to worry about a cat. Sorry, Coon. These are all messages on Coonstagram. Alright, so, you know, oh, let's, how do I access my inventory? That's right. So I got the Coonstagram app. Let's take a look at it. So there's those messages from Jimmy, Cartman, Ike, and Jesus. So Ike is uh, Kyle's little brother. He's Canadian, so he's got the little flappy head. So the way that I'm going to do it is... Whenever it shows a character as themselves, so for example, Cartman just in his normal clothes, I'm going to refer to him as Cartman, but when he's in his suit, uh, his coon suit, I will refer to him as the coon. So, um, yeah, just remember who everybody is and who their personas are. So remember, uh, Kyle is Human Kite, uh, Stan, we haven't seen him yet, he's Toolshed, Token, also haven't seen him yet, is Tupperware, 
uh, Craig is Super Craig, Clyde is Mosquito, uh, and Jimmy is um, Fast Pass. So let's see who... Uh, see, I'm not following anybody on Coonstagram right now. Can I follow Cartman and them? No, I, I can't right now. I have six followers, though. Let's see. Costumes. So it looks like I can change out my costume. I don't want to wear those stupid tidy whities Um... Oh, I can change the color of it. That's kind of cool. Uh, yeah, I'm going to wear something else. There's an Assassin's Creed hood. Uh, an Iron Man mask. Uh, Alright, this one is Super Streamer Headwear. So it's a purple ski cap with a headset. Um, kind of like I wear, except the ski cap. So, you know, I'm going to do that. I'm going to wear that. So I look like a streamer. Uh, they also have Cartman's wizard hat. I cannot wear anything if I want to, but yeah, I'm going to keep the streamer hat. That's cool. Clothes, let's see. S some stuff I can only access if I'm like a prime member. That sucks. Uh, there's streamer clothing, Cartman's clothing, Princess Kenny's gown. I'm going to stick with the blaster shirt. Hands, let's see what else I got. I just have different gloves. Some of them don't have the uh, the little bottles on them. I'm going to keep the bottles. They look kind of cool. Eyewear. You know, let's give me some glasses. Why not? Hair. There's a Oh, I can change my hairstyle anytime I want. That's super cool. Face makeup. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. All right. Well, that's all I'm going to change. Take a look at my character sheet. It tracks your progress throughout your superhero adventure. Earn titles to fill out your character sheet. You'll get XP, and the coon will leave a reward in your toy box. Cool. So there's different achievements that I can do. Yeah, so I don't really have, um, I don't really have a title yet, but I can get them from solving puzzles, collecting artifacts, pretty cool. And it looks like I can change my class anytime I want, that is super cool. As of right now, I'm stuck as a blaster, but hey, you never know. Alright, so I'm outside. Collect followers by getting people to take selfies with you. So Cartman's mom is out here, so... Let's see. I can take selfies with people that have a camera icon above their heads. Oh, there's an old lady here, let's talk to her. All right. Yay, I Mrs. Farnacle, that's her name. So I have a new follower. Wonderful. I'll see you on the internet. All right. So now I can open up my phone, open Coonstagram, and I can see the selfies. So I can actually change my expression on them. It's pretty neat. Uh, Mrs. Farnacle is now a follower. Only people who post pose in your selfies will follow you. Nice. And then I can see who I'm following, so yeah. When someone follows you, you'll automatically follow them back. Gain more followers to increase your hero rank in your character sheet. Alright, let's see, can I take a selfie with that kid? Yep, one of the Moorish kids is sweeping the sweeping Cartman's driveway. No way I can't take a selfie with a nobody like you. You'll need more followers before I selfie with you. Okay, well, let's see what's in Cartman's garage. Ooh, I got a costume. Oh, it looks like I can craft in this game. Pretty sweet. Hmm, there's some type of object up on that shelf, but I can't get it yet. Alright, let's get out of here then. See, do I have a map of South Park? Doesn't look like I have a map yet. Maybe I need to download like Google Maps or something. Um, New kid. Looks like you've reached the edge of our known universe. Beyond there lies the limits of time and space. Oh, it looks like I can't go that way yet. So some areas are blocked off to me. Hmm. One of those Moorish kids. Let's see. Look, I only selfie with popular people. Dang. All right, looks like is that that's Butters' house, I think. Let's see if I can go in. Yep, it's Butters' house. The layout's a little bit different from Stick of Truth. 
I can't take a selfie with him yet. Oh, I can take a photo anytime I want. Cool. Oh. Just getting some items. I can't take a selfie with Butters' mom either. Let's talk to her. If you have time to clean, you have time to obsessively scrub dishes until your hands are raw and bleeding. Wow, that's dark. Okay, let's go upstairs. Oh, is there some stuff there? Okay. All right, let's check out Butters' room. Oh, it's the bathroom. Okay. Yeah, the layouts are a little different here. Oh, got another costume part. I'll just have to collect them all and see what I can get. Hmm, there's a safe here, but I guess I don't know the combo yet. I'm in their bedroom. Oh, so it looks like the door to Butters' room is locked. Looks like I need some type of code or something. All right, this looks like a guest room, or is this Butters' room? I don't know, hard to tell. It's real nicely decorated, little pink stuff. Yeah, it's a guest room. All right, let's get out of Butters' house and let's keep going. Another more kid. Oh, the king's back. Ooh, I can get a selfie with this kid. All right, let's change my mood. I can zoom. All right, that's as far as I can zoom. Let's take a photo. Uh, yeah, let's do a let's do a filter. Why not? Uh, I guess I just took that photo. I didn't get him as a follower. Oh, the mailman here. Let's see. Can't get this mailbox open. Oh. Hey, you, you got it open. You're the real deal, little superhero. A, a selfie? Sure, kid. Let's do it. Oh, there we go. I can get a selfie with this guy. All right, there we go. Yay! I got the postman as a follower. Yay, I can get a selfie with this more kid. I'm just gonna take photos. Maddie, okay. We're friends now, I guess. Let's see if I can follow. Well, I guess we have enough mutuals that we can selfie. Yay, I can selfie with these guys. Sweet. Oh, it's it's the Star Trek kid, Kevin Stoley. Okay. You're gaining followers pretty fast. Keep up the good work. I'm still having trouble reaching some of the Kuhn friends. You might want to see what's going on. Hmm. Ooh. I leveled up as an influencer. Nice. Ah, okay. Ooh, I have a map app. Yay! All right, so... So there are missions I can do. Okay, so let's take a look at the map. It looks basically the same as the map in Stick of Truth, yeah? Everything is exactly where it used to be. It's just now there's more... Uh, info on the map. It looks like, yeah, there's places I can't go yet. Did Canada build a border wall? <gasps> they did! Oh. Let's see, it's showing information about the different stores. Cool, so let's find a mission. Yeah, so we can meet Kyle or Super Craig. So let's talk to Super Craig first. All right, so I've pinned it. Excellent. All right, I guess I'm good. 
Oh, I can access the mini map. Oh, I have a mini map. It's so cool. And then I can access the regular map from there. Sweet. All right, let's see if I can get those other Moors as my followers. Okay, I guess you're popular enough to selfie with. Johnny. All right. We're friends now, I guess. All right, there was that one other kid. Okay, we can get a selfie together. Yay! Andre. All right. Cool. We follow each other now. Yeah. So that's the edge of time and space. Oh no! I can I can keep going now. Well, what's up, Randy? Hey, kid. You know anything about this? Somebody's keying my wife's car at night. It's happening every night. I thought it was just one of you damn kids, but well, here, come here, take a look at this. Whoever's scratching the car is also leaving notes. I'm just scared it's a jilted lover or something. You won't forget me that easy. I thought we had something. I'll tell the world about you, bitch. Listen, I'm sick of having to buff this shit out. If you can catch whoever's keying my wife's car tonight, I'll follow you on Coonstagram. Trust me, Sweet. you want me as a follower. I'm a pretty big deal in this town. <laughs> I love Randy. All right. Yeah, I'll have to see who's doing that. Here's Stan's house. Let's see, who can I take selfies with? Grandpa and Shelly. Yeah, Grandpa calls everybody Billy. Oh my god, I have to give him a condom before he'll take a selfie with me? All right, let's see about Shelly. No way, Kurt. Your follower count is way too low. I gotta protect my hashtag brand. Oh my gosh. Hey there, I'm Callie, your gaming bug. Remember, when snooping around someone's house, always check their refrigerator. There's always some good shit to steal in the fridge. All right, looks like I installed the crafting app. Let's take a look at it and see what I can craft. It lets you create a range of useful things with recipes you find. All right. So I can make an antidote. Removes negative status effects. Sweet. Ah, uh, yeah. Oh, it looks like I can level up uh, if I craft a whole bunch. Nice. All right, well... Oh, you know what? Is there more stuff I can do here? Nah, there's nothing I can craft beyond just the antidote yet, so, okay. Let's snoop around Stan's room. He's got a Captain America shield in there. Toolshed character sheet. Excellent. Let's take a look. see. How come I can't access it? Oh well. I'll, I'll see what that does later. Parents room. Oh my god, I got a bra hat. <laughs> See, there's a spot on the wall I can break. Oh, you know what? There's a pipe there. I wonder if I can get small, like in the other game, and go through there. I think that's what it's hinting at, but I don't have that ability yet. Oh, hey, Shelly's room. It's all full of, like, stuffed bunnies and unicorns. Yeah. All right. Well, I think that's all I can do in Stan's house for the time being. There are uh, locked doors in here as well. Yeah, so there's things that I can do later here. All right, let's keep moving. Ah, I see you've made it to the Palace of the Clouds. That's home base to human kite. Perhaps you can find him inside. Oh yeah, that is one of the objectives. Is I have to talk to Kyle. See, there's a bag here that I can 
get stuff out of. All right. So I was in his garage. Let's head into Kyle's house. You know, let me take a look at the map. Let's see, pin that objective. Yeah, I'll do this as the mission right now as a human kite. Oh, here he is. Who the hell are you? Really? You sent a newbie to my distress call? You're such a dick, Coon. Sorry, kid, but my problem is too big for a rookie. A few days ago, there was an anomaly in the universe. Another version of me, the human kite from an alternate dimension, showed up here and is destroying everything. Right now, it's upstairs in my room. I don't think anything can stop it. Hmm. Alternate human kite. All right, let's go to his room. Human kite from another universe is behind this door. I can't fight him for obvious reasons, you know. Alternative universe paradox shit. So you are going to have to take him out. You've got to really kick his ass, dude, so that he wants to return back to his universe on the East Coast. You ready? All right, go get him. Oh, hey, Kyle. I'm big. So this is uh, Kyle's cousin, Kyle Schwartz. Uh, he is your very stereotypical Jewish kid. He's got real frizzy hair, big old glasses, he's kind of pudgy, and he speaks in that Jewish, uh, you know, that East Coast uh, Jewish kind of accent. And yeah, well, let's just, let's just do this. And he's dressed in the same human kite costume, but it looks way more ridiculous. The Human Kite 2 from an alternate universe. from another universe we're like best super pals <laughs> as you can see he is the one running around giving the human kite a bad name he was sent here to destroy me and weaken my power no no i came to spend two weeks with my cousin and wanted to play superheroes and then he said okay what superhero do you want to be and i said i want to be human kite but he said you can't be human kite i'm human kite and i said well why can't we be human kites together so i went to aunt sheila and i said i want to be human kite together and she told him he had to do what i said because i was the guest wow remember I'm sorry, me from another universe, but it is time for you to learn that playing superheroes is too painful. New kid, you must now destroy my alter ego. Oh, Jesus, we're gonna fight? That's right. If you really want to play, then this is how you do it. Well, all right. Anything to make me and my cousin more alike. Prepare for battle, weakling. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be sad. All right, let's fight, quote, evil human kite. All right, let's start combat. So it's just me and him. All right, let's see what abilities I can do at this point. All right, let's. All right, I shot some. Uh, I shot some fireballs at him. He's got burn damage now. Oh. All right, let's do another one of those blasts. Oh, time those wrong. Jeez, did you have to hit so hard? Okay, I think my inner ear fluids have stabilized now. Uh, that last hit didn't count, right? I'm undoing that damage, okay, Kyle? Uh, oh, he can heal. Classic alternate universe bullshit. Does anyone have hydrocodone cream, preferably prescription strength? Hold on, right. I need a timeout so I can use my inhaler. Let's try another ability, plasma beam. That wasn't bad. Cousin Kyle, I called the timeout and he didn't listen. You know my asthma flares up when I exert myself. Yeah, I think this would be a lot more fair if I had a shield. Some kind of shield, like a like the safer Tura, which also has a great sentimental value. Dude, human kite is an alien. There's no Jewish stuff involved. And you can't just make up powers in the middle of a battle. I'm not making it up, it's totally canon in my alternate universe. Oh my god. So he's got a shield made out of a Torah? Oh my god. Kyle just used, or cousin Kyle just used protection indicated by the blue bar above his health. Protection absorbs all damage until depleted. All right. 
happening now. Wait, I thought I should get this turn instead of the new kid because he didn't wait when I said time out earlier, so I think it should be my turn now. Are you kidding me? That's totally cheating. God, he's annoying. That wasn't too hard, right? I don't want to cause any permanent damage. And, and, and some help applying it. All right, here we go. My super ultimate power. Get ready. Are you ready? Oh, Jesus. Okay, Rath Kite from an alternate universe. He's okay, so he's getting on the bed. And what's he doing? He's just. Oh! So he tried to jump on me, but he just damaged himself for full damage. He fell. Oh, God, he's got a nosebleed. <gasps> Ooh, and I got some more costume bits. Excellent. Really hurts. I better go back to my universe. Oh, you're leaving? Dude, that sucks. Yeah, I'll be going back to my universe now, human kite. I need some camphor panique for my ear because I got a scrape on it for being farted on. <laughs> Dude, I don't know how to thank you. From now on, call me whenever you need help. Alright, so I got human kite as a combat buddy. Excellent. Let's take a selfie with him. Okay, yeah, just two heroes hanging out. Alright, I'm gonna change my mood for this one. Oh, there's a lot of moods I can go through. Eh, it's just smile. There we go. Yay! I got Kyle as a follower on Coonstagram. Hmm, I got Human Kite's character sheet. Let's see what it says about that. Nope, that's not what I want. Human kite. Kite alien, asexual, gender neutral kite alien, uh, lawful kite theologist, solar. Let's see. Oh, okay. So race, ethnicity, kite alien, sex, gender, asexual, gender neutral kite alien, alignment, lawful, religion, kite theologist, power source, solar winds, and his kryptonite is his mom. Let's see. Oh, I see. So now I can access their character sheets. I don't really know anything about Toolshed yet. Real name Stan Marsh. Let's see, Kyle. Human Kite is a blaster like me. Um, Toolshed is a gadgeteer. Interesting. Well, that's pretty much all I got for today. So I'm going to go ahead and save. And I will see you guys next time.